let's take a new exercise in solid worksheet metal and in this exercise we will create a vent and a lure with the help of sheet metal feature okay so first we will draw okay let's read notes all dimensions in millimeter uh, okay all bend radius are one millimeter material thickness one millimeter raw material steel alloy density 770 kg per cubic meter okay now here we have one flattened view all the bending you will see down everything see here a b c d all bend down 90 degree radius inner radius one millimeter okay now this is the front view these two are top view and this is side view okay so first we will make outer geometry length 100 by 60 millimeter thickness 1 millimeter then we will extrude this one and how long we need to extrude this one uh, we are going to extrude this one 12 millimeter see here 12 millimeter and if you see in this look this shape this is a, a, a type of cut relief uh, I'll show you how this is going to be achieved then uh, corner fillet uh, chamfer 2 millimeter and here also we have one cutout this width 80 millimeter see here 80 millimeter so here we have one cutout 10 millimeter uh, let's see how we will achieve this now okay sheet metal go to okay let's front plane sketch now activate center rectangle and let me draw a rectangle 60 tap 100 millimeter enter right click exit now go to sheet metal and activate base flange now look material move this side thickness 1 millimeter k factor 0.5 this is standard and here I am going to use uh, later we will use this say ok Now in sheet metal there is an option called break corner corner relief. Now chamfer 2 mm and directly choose this face. See system going to detect all corners but this is going to be 10 mm. Okay. Now if we select the edge this is 180 mm, 80 mm. See this is what I want to achieve. Now let's go edge flange. And now I want to make back side so let's select back edge drag and drop somewhere here okay bend radius it's defined here let's say one millimeter this is important radius 90 degree now 12 millimeter is the length okay now material we will keep inside if you are going to see from this side see material going to keep inside this is important Okay, let's select all the edges. But there is a problem. If you see, there is a cut relief. Go to custom relief type. And here I am going to choose drop down and choose tier look if you choose this one let's say okay look this is seems like something let's say flatten view now let's again edit age flange come down and here choose the second option here in teen extend if you see the front view and see how this is going to extend say ok and here look the shape now again I am going to make corner relief this time 2 millimeter chamfer and I am going to select directly face Paste will detect corner and apply. So this is the simple procedure. See. Okay. Now let's apply hole. Then we will apply this vent. 7 this side. 5 this side. Similarly 7, 5. 
एंड होल डायमीटर ऑल होल थ्री मिलीमीटर नाउ लेट्स चूज अनफोल्ड सिलेक्ट दिस बैक पैनल कलेक्ट ऑल बैंड इधर यू कैन चूज मैनुअली से ओके नाउ सब सिलेक्ट स्केच नाउ लेट्स मेक हियर होल बिफोर गोइंग दैट आई एम गोइंग टू मेक वन वर्टिकल एंड हॉरिजोनटल लाइन दिस इज मेक्स आर लाइफ ईजी थ्री मिलीमीटर एंटर राइट क्लिक चूज सेलेक्ट एंड एग्जिट ना लेट्स डिफाइन द पोजिशन सेवन मिलीमीटर फाइव मिलीमीटर चूज मिरर सिलेक्ट दिस वन मिरर अबाउट सिलेक्ट दिस वन ओके अगेन चूज मिरर नाउ दिस टाइम आई एम गोइंग टू सिलेक्ट दिस टू होल्स मेक श्योर वी सिलेक्टेड कॉपी मिरर अबाउट दिस लाइन से ओके एंड सी दिस इज गोइंग टू मिरर नाउ लेट्स मेक हियर होल थ्री मिलीमीटर स्मार्ट डायमेंशन एंड डिफाइन फाइव मिलीमीटर एंड डिस्टेंस फ्रॉम आउटर एज सेवन मिलीमीटर मिरर एंटिटी सिलेक्ट दिस मेक श्योर यू सिलेक्टेड कॉपी नाउ आई एम गोइंग टू सिलेक्ट दिस लाइन ओके नाउ सी इट इज मिरर नाउ सिलेक्ट बोथ दी सर्कल हॉरिजोनटल लाइन दिस टाइम ओके सी द होल इज क्रिएटेड गो टू शीट मेटल एंड एक्टिवेट एक्सक्लूडेड कट फीचर नाउ हियर चूज एंड कंडीशन और डायरेक्शन ब्लाइंड अनचेक यू कैन अप्लाई द थिकनेस वॉट एवर यू वॉन्ट टू कट बट देर इज ऑप्शन कॉल्ड लिंक टू थिकनेस इफ यू सिलेक्ट दिस इट विल कट अप टू द थिकनेस ऑफ मटीरियल से ओके सी नाउ लेट्स फोल्ड इट बिकॉज इफ यू आर गोइंग टू नो देर इज ऑप्शन फोल्ड फेस सिलेक्टेड कलेक्ट बेड इवन दो मैनुअली यू कैन सिलेक्ट सी आई एम गोइंग टू सिलेक्ट मैनुअली ऑल बेड ओके ओके दैट्स इट नाउ लेट्स स्टार्ट टू क्रिएट वेंट फॉर दिस नाउ लुक लुक दिस वेंट शेप दिस इज एक्चुअली ए कट आउट सो वाइल क्रिएटिंग वेंट वी हैव टू एड मटीरियल ओके सी आउटर वन आर सेवेंटीन इनर वन आर फिफ्टीन एंड द थर्ड वन आर थर्टीन सो वी हैव टू एड मटीरियल बिटवीन आर थर्टीन एंड आर फोर्टीन सो इन बिटवीन टू मिलीमीटर डिफरेंस दिस इज रेडियस सो दिस गोइंग टू बी क्रिएट इज रेडियस आर सेवेंटीन सॉरी आर फोर्टीन आर फोर्टीन मीन्स रेडियस जस्ट डब अ डायमीटर जस्ट डबल ट्वेंटी एट ओके नाउ सिमिलरली बिटवीन दीज टू लाइन आर इलेवन आर नाइन आर टेन मीन्स ट्वेंटी रेडियस वी हैव टू क्रिएट देन हियर यू विल सी द डिस्टेंस टू मिलीमीटर This is the rib distance two millimeter radius R one. Now the radius going to okay for this between these two and now at two millimeter means there is a five six twelve millimeter. Okay, here we have to create twelve millimeter. So R fourteen then ten uh, for okay. Then twenty, then this radius twelve. Okay. Select this face, sketch, activate circle. Now first outer circle. Outer circle is seventeen into two. But for rib cutout, fourteen radius we calculated fourteen into two. It's twenty eight. Then we calculated between eleven and nine. It's ten. Ten into two. Then here one more. Twelve. Line. Up to here. Escape. Again, apply line. From one end to another end. Okay. Let's apply distance. Twenty five, and this distance from outer edge, just half thirty. 
look it seems fully defined this sketch simply go to sheet metal activate vent feature now first you have to define outer boundary or close boundary so i am going to select outer now see now radius i will define later rib select these two ribs now look the rib width is only 2 mm according to our drawing see come sparse let me select this 1 2 3 now this is 2 mm so once you calculate you will get the result this one 17 this is going to r 14 15 now we don't need to fill the boundary here choose radius let's say 1 mm click somewhere here and you will see the shape this is what the shape we need rest everything as it is see the rib is created a uh, vent is created now let's make a rib uh, sorry lower 25 length 14 length we will change it a standard rib i think something different 25 15 is the distance and be distance between these two is 15 mm okay so go to design library drop down forming tool emboss lure okay just drag and drop so drag and drop here now look first we need to change angle 270 look okay this is going to be we need but lure end should be bottom now flip see this is comes this side perfect position smart dimension distance from outer edge it's 25 and distance from this one 15 now it seems fully defined now so do one thing select this point and the this point go inside look it seems fully defined this sketch say okay go to feature linear pattern now select direction so i am going to move this direction now feature directly choose this one now see the distance between these 10 make 15 see three number of patterns or three number of lures we need direction 2 is we don't need say okay now if you click on this you will see the distance 4 and 6 so double click on 32 and make 25 similarly select this one make 4 and just refresh see it's smaller see 25 4 that's it okay right click on edit material steel alloy steel density 7007700 kg per cubic meter say apply close that's it if you go to sheet metal open see right click export to dxf panel dxf file save now sheet metal now what things you want to export geometry bend line sketches forming tool let's do it say okay now even you can change this also but uh, it looks perfect see save it that's it Don't forget to share, like our video, and please subscribe our channel for more video and more projects in SolidWorks. Thanks for watching.